This video is about zippers on your pants that can be blocking the view of the coccyx on x-rays. Uh, so for people for tail with tailbone pain, if they have uh, an x-ray done of the coccyx, uh, they can have zippers on their pants that can get in the way of the x-rays, which if they are not uh, changed into a gown uh, to have the x-rays taken. Uh, I'm Dr. Patrick Foy. I'm the director of the Coccyx Pain Center here in the United States. I'm online at www.tailbonedoctor.com and I've been treating people with tailbone pain for 20 some years now. I've treated thousands of patients and unfortunately from time to time there'll be somebody who comes in and they bring their x-rays with them uh, that they had done previously at an outside institution uh, and we'll take a look at the x-rays to take a look and see if they show the coccyx or tailbone and what happens is right what happened here which is the tailbone is hidden behind the zipper of the patient's pants. Uh, so this is a view of the uh, you know, pelvis right here. Uh, so I don't know if this will show up, uh, you know, kind of I'm in a dark room at the moment. Um, but I'm holding up an anatomic model uh, of the pelvis and at the back of the pelvis you can see the sacrum and coccyx there. Um, but on this x-ray, here's our pelvis, the sacrum is back here, the coccyx would be hidden right behind the zipper. Um, it's also, in this case, hidden behind the pubic bone, but, uh, but for purposes of this uh, x-ray uh, and this point of this video, even if the, the uh, image was appropriately tilted to show the coccyx, the zipper would still be blocking the view of the coccyx. Um, and it's really a shame because people have tailbone pain and they suffer for months and years, often without an accurate diagnosis. And one of the reasons why they suffer uh, for years without an accurate diagnosis is because uh, so many places do the wrong imaging studies or do the imaging studies the wrong way. Uh, so in this patient, uh, again, the exact area that was the study was being done for, which was tailbone pain, the tailbone is hidden behind the zipper of the person's pants, and here's the buckle uh, in the or the uh, button or um, you know uh, rivet or whatever uh, just above the uh, zipper at the front of the person's pants, uh, and you can see some of the other you know rivets uh, here. Uh, and here for the you know for the side pockets uh, of the pants. Um, so again, the, this could be very easily fixed by just having the patient change into a gown, uh, you know, or into you know, a pair of uh, shorts even uh, that does not have any buttons or zippers in the patient's clothing. And especially that if it did have buttons or zippers, that you do the imaging studies in such a way that it's not blocking the area that you are uh, most interested uh, in you know, for that patient. Um, so that's the, um, that's the general uh, take-home message. Uh, the other thing that can be done, of course, is to do a, a, the x-ray uh, from the side uh, so that instead of, uh, instead of uh, only taking the x-ray uh, from that front view where you can see right now the pubic bone is blocking the view, now the tailbone comes in, um, but if the zipper was there, it would still be blocked. But the other thing you can do is to take the image from the side, which is more aligned, you know, kind of like this. Uh, which is a, called a lateral view in uh, medical lingo. Um, so those are a couple of points about uh, the x-rays of the coccyx and um, avoiding having a zipper get in the way of the coccyx or tailbone on your x-rays. Uh, for more information, you can uh, find me online at tailbonedoctor.com uh, or on uh, Twitter at tailbonedoctor. And um, if you have questions about this, you can post them down below this video. Bye-bye.